Hi, this is Eric Jacobus, I'm stunt coordinator for Midnight Fight Express. And we're at the Super Alloy Studios in Las Vegas. Originally, I'm a stuntman and indie filmmaker, and you might know me from games like God of War, Mortal Kombat 11, and also Tekken in real life. It's been two years since I did God of War, and now I have my own studio to do motion capture for games like Jacob's. Super Alloy Interactive is an action design studio for movies, games, and any interactive media. We specialize in motion capture, previs, we do wires, we have a gymnastics floor. So anything action related, we cover it at our studio. How did we meet Jacob? It's actually a funny story. So I saw Jacob had posted videos of his game. And I said, uh, how do we contact this guy? I want to get involved in this game because I want to do motion capture for this game. I couldn't get a hold of him. And then one day out of the blue, his publisher contacts me and says, uh, hey, uh, we're working on this cool new indie Polish game. Are you interested in doing motion capture for it? I said, yeah, what is it? And he showed me this game. And I said, I've been dying to work on this game, so hook us up. Super Alloy Interactive is independent at heart because we all come from the indie world. Working with Jacob, also an independent game developer, it was a perfect match. So then I brought in Jay Huerto, who's an old friend of mine. We go back 20 years. He's an indie filmmaker, an indie stunt guy. He does live shows and he knows wrestling and he knows all these interesting styles. So Jay and I would come up with one set of moves for this direction, and then Jay would go over here, and then we would come up with a totally different set of choreography for that direction, a totally different set of choreography for that direction, and a totally different set for that. We ended up getting through 250 shots in a single day which is kind of crazy for motion capture. You're talking about 65 moves times four. We have to move a little faster today because, you know, we need to do as much as we can. Even but, faster? Yeah, even faster. <laughs> People like Jay make it really easy because, he, again, he's a very well-trained stuntman. And Jacob understood the whole action language, too. He actually had seen a lot of the same movies that we had, and so he got the references. Originally, Jacob was hand animating the entire game, so we were able to take our motion capture process and integrate it directly into his workflow. You guys, is this actually the preferred method from now on, using this split screen thing? Because it looks pretty good, actually. Yeah, we prefer this. We did this entirely over the internet, so we would teleconference with each other, and we choreographed it there on the spot with him while he was talking to us from Poland. Hey, Jacob. Yeah? And he throws a punch. Boom, and I do a kick. Wham! Can you stagger off to the left like that? Or, or to the yeah. right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. he can. Is that okay, Jacob? Yeah, great. So we were already doing a full remote motion capture session way before coronavirus. That allowed us to actually transition really easily into a remote workflow. This game is the perfect matchup between an indie game developer who's based in Poland and an indie action studio based in Las Vegas. Jacob's game really is an indie action game with heart. Thank you.